Just a couple of pals grabbing lunch. All right, buddy. But rather than talk How over the noise of the lunchroom, Zui Win and fourth grader Jamari Rembert yeah. grab a seat outside. What, do you, what position are you going to play? I think I'm going to play running back or try out for quarterback. Non stop chatter. After all, that's what friends do tell each other everything. We made a promise that we were going to tell each other the truth. Important because Zui is here to help. He's Jamari's mentor through Lunch Pals, a district-wide program that pairs students up with volunteers for weekly visits just like this. Say it's Sunday. I, I'd be like counting the days down until he comes and then yesterday, I, I, when I woke up, I was so happy that he was going to come because like he, he inspires me. Surprising to hear a young person so eager to sit down with an adult, especially when the conversation takes a more serious turn. Like what should I do if somebody keep messing with me? Should I fight him or not? What does he say? Not. I don't want him to not tell me he got in trouble for fear of judgment or anything, because it really is kind of a judgment-free zone. And that's how Zui has gained Jamari's trust, listening, and of course chiming in with advice when needed. The kind of friend every kid wants. That's what I hope I am for him. Just, just somebody who can absorb and, you know, just be there. Just a couple of pals talking over lunch. I'm probably going to be number two. Number two? Is that yeah, a good number? I want to I be number two. But as simple as it sounds, these are conversations that can help shape a life. In St. Petersburg, Kate McVeigh, Spectrum, Bay News 9.